If you've ever wanted to keep your smartphone safe when using it in a wet environment without losing any of the functionality, this product might be for you, so stick around. Hey everyone, Jameson here with TechSeeker.net reviewing the Ultra Proof Ultra Pouch Waterproof Smartphone Bag. I recently did a review on one of these, although it was the version that could fit up to 5.3 inch devices. This is the 6.3 inch device, which is going to work out much better for my Nexus 6P, my actual one, not my cardboard cutout. I'm using it to record this video right now, so I'll throw up pictures. But uh, you can find this for under about $10 on Amazon, and uh, it's this one's a little bit different than the 5.3, and I'd recommend it for a number of reasons. So we're just going to do a quick unbagging of it. And it comes with the accessories you would expect of Tethys series devices or uh, cases or bags or whatever you want to call them. Uh, it comes with the lanyard, which is, again, that nice silky material. It's the wide band, so if this is on your bare skin for a long time, it's not going to dig into you. It's really nice there. Uh, it's about a foot long, and it does have the detachable strap, so you can take your smartphone off and give it to someone else and clip it back on and not have to worry too much about losing it. So that's really nice to have that functionality. It also comes with the Velcro band, which you'd expect. Uh, also, very nice Velcro on that. It's not the super scratchy kind. It's very soft, so if this is against your skin for a long period of time, it's not going to hurt you very much. <laughs> and uh, that threads right through the back of the phone. There's a reinforced uh, part of the TPU that you can just thread it right through, attach that to your arm or wherever. And the, I guess, bag itself is the same basic construction as the other device. Um, that I covered. So it has like these swivel latches. So I'll show you, I'll get a closer shot of this as well, uh, where it kind of pushes the TPU in on itself in a V groove pattern to make it waterproof up to four meters. So, uh, I mean, that's good for, you know, snorkeling or whatever you're gonna be doing, poolside, I'm not sure. If you're going any deeper, if you're scuba diving, you might wanna get something else, but I'm, I guarantee this is gonna work fine for your average person. And uh, yeah, here's the device itself. So as you can see, the front bezel um, is much, much thinner. In fact, it's non-existent on the 5.3 inch edition. It actually goes in maybe quarter, half inch in there. And that's a problem for me because my Nexus 6P barely fit and the front facing camera was covered up by that bezel. Uh, with this full thing, you can see everything. It's just beautiful. Uh, the back window is also a little bit bigger. so. Uh, that's nice too. I don't see any problem with a lot of smartphones. I mean, even the 6P works with this, and I take the 6P as an extreme example because the cameras are very close to the edge on the front and back. And uh, it even works with this. You can see there's a bit of a uh, bezel there as well, but it works perfectly in there. So if you're watching this on Amazon, um, I will be uploading a different version of the video where I'll be using this in a more tropical environment. I've tested it so far in the bathtub. Uh, not very exciting, but on YouTube I'll put a little annotation to um, my tropical adventures where I got to test this in a really cool uh, area in Mexico, and that's coming up in uh, June 2016, but um, I'm liking this so far. It, it's just like the other version of it, which I'd recommend, uh, which is a little, a little cheaper, but this is like a dollar more than the other one, so um, if it really matters to you, you know, you can save money and go down that way, but I'd recommend either. It's a great gift, uh, good stocking stuffer. I bought a few last year. And uh, yeah, if you like the product, please use my Amazon link in the description below. It really helps me out, helps me buy new equipment for this channel to make better, bigger, longer videos. And uh, yeah, if you have any questions, drop them in the comments below. I would love to start a conversation with you. This has been Jameson with TechSeeker.net, and I will catch you next time. See ya.